I'm leading the activity of recruitment within Drexel My Group. So I'm not going to take too much to talk. First, I will start with the video. Then it will be more interactive towards you. By the end of the day, you are the talents of the future. So it will be up to you. OK? Uh, can start. So, every time I'm watching this video, it's really important for us and for all Tunisia, honestly. Because having such big projects in Tunisia as Draxomaya, giving the opportunities to all different kind of categories of our people, from operators to engineers to managers, that's really important. And that's why it was the idea at the beginning to share with you the talent first. This panel is to discuss with you how we are doing it in Tunisia. And the idea of Draxomai, I'll just explain what's Draxomai, because it's not even known too much in Tunisia while it was existing since 1958, actually, in the worldwide. And what was really important, that we have different activities and so on, but in Tunisia, we were here since 1974. And when we say over these 40 years or five years, One. As well, in Tunisia, we know
baby. It's in Jamal and it's specialized only for electrical cars. Okay, but in order like to succeed this, we have with the revolution of Industry 4.0. Do you have any industrial engineer here among you? Electrical engineer, management student. What do you do, guys? شو تقرأوا؟ شو تقرأوا؟ أفلوماتيك أبليكا لجيسيون That's in management سيدا عندي سخير أوكي سوري as well in the management IT he want to tell me a secret ah good we need you we have a whole protocol for health so it's totally fine we never succeed the production activities quality activities logistic activities without the support function which come like from IT or management and we have different uh, uh, excellent centers that we call which are the IT center the design center as well we have what we call proof technique or test engineering center and now we're having other center which is specialized for designing the maquette and so on or the like in the production as well we are having different protocols from HR finance purchasing and so on or the like to support the activities within the plants okay Okay, that's enough promotion about the company. We will back to the talent first. I just wanted to introduce the company so you know what we are doing, okay? There is no answer as well. I can, you can send maybe even more 100. And then you have no answers. And that's frustrating. I was there once. So I know what it's about. Now I will give you the other part of the story. How the recruiters are operating or how the HR people are operating. Okay. First of all, I'll be showing you the
and that we are 90% sure that we're going to hire them after that internship or that graduation project. That's why we are doing it this way. All of it has been changed. We moved from, let's say, the most known thing, hire to fire, owning the whole process from hiring the person, integrating them, then we, then they, they are leaving, they, they, we can fire them. Nowadays, with the new generation, we are hiring to aspire people. Why we say that? It's okay to find the right person. It's okay to integrate them, but we should develop them the right way the right projects with the right opportunities in order like, to grow up according to their career aspirations. We are not anymore just working from nine to five, pay by the end of the month and go home. People now are the new generation that are willing, yeah, especially millennial generation, we are willing to leave an impact, which is totally fine. But we should be sure to provide them with the right tools, with the Where is the problem? We have fresh graduated, we have profile, even we have experienced profile. And they are all of them blaming or maybe doing some complaining that they have no jobs. Why? Because they are not ready to the position. I'm the head of personal or marketing and recruitment. And when I come into the room, when I'm doing it, not expecting to have maybe let's say, uh, a top gun profile. We are looking for someone who are meeting the requirements. I'm facing sometimes, like the situation when I'm opening a position even for pro managers, and someone he's applying to me is out of the requirements. They don't even take the time to read what is the profile requirements, or what is the mission. And they come to me to the interview, uh, okay, I just applied and I have no idea, and you know, Drexel may maybe in the cable and bullshit. Of course, I'm not interested to you anymore, okay? The minimum things, if I'm as a recruiter, will do my homework and I will read your resume to understand what are your experiences. To share these things, just to make the awareness. The opportunities are here as long as you are ready for it. Because when the opportunity is going to knock the door, if you are not ready, you'll just miss it.
Well, I'm not against going to have international experience or against having international culture, multicultural things. It's totally fine. But just... We are not finding the right fit. If I'm going to just hire someone and then going to lift after two months, it's a waste for my time, for the company uh, money, and for their time. So we make sure to make the right selection from the beginning. And this is the way to guarantee a win-win situation for both. For Tunisian people or Tunisian talent, and as well the company we are operating in. Okay. I know that today there is a lot of curriculum, especially for the engineering polytech, I, I think, that they are focusing on English, communication, and so on. I was there once, once a time, <laughs> once, once, once a time. And that's really important to use this chance. Why? Because you are having the moment or the area where you can make mistakes and no one gonna judge you. One gonna to have initiatives, and I know that some categories will say, "Hey, we are living in very activities like dynamic ecosystem that are talking about entrepreneurship, which is okay, totally fine. The main or principle of entrepreneurship is initiative. Take the initiative, even if you are students, take it. If you are professional, try to improve." Your self-improvement will lead you to other doors and will help you to develop your activities. And from the side of being an entrepreneur, it's a really fancy idea to have an independency and autonomy mindset that will allow you to grow Okay, companies are seeking for the best person that will be performant later on and to lead more projects, more results, and more benefits to the company. This benefits to the company will be leading as well benefits to that brilliant employee or that talent that he has been hired, developed, and he's performing and inspiring others how they like to be developing and so on. Having a team, that's really important point. You need to influence them, you need to protect them, you need to grow them. And the only main duty to for you when you have a team is how will your team gonna succeed. Because if they're gonna succeed, automatically you will succeed. Okay? Well, I'm being brief. I don't want to take too much time to, to talk about this. So if you have any question, anything about Draxemaya, anything about the talent, either acquisition, development, or retaining, please feel free to ask me any question you want. Uh, it's about the summer internships. I wanted to ask, uh, how do you actually accept people? Uh, if I want to apply, what do you like? What are the requirements?
well. Okay. Universities. Our recruitment team gonna to do the filter or the pre-screening according to the project requirements. For instance, if it's a logistic position or logistic uh, project and of uh, graduation project, we will they will be needing some specificities or technical activities in uh, in, the, in the logistic department or logistic uh, area. Okay. If that profile who applied is meeting the requirements, for sure gonna call them. And you're gonna have to check the English. You're gonna check the communication, the interest in the company. If they are good, we're gonna to invite them to what we call an assessment day to meet all the country board and to have one-to-one -one meeting with the department manager. Later on, we decide which one to go through the graduation project, okay? As, the, as well, for the same for summer internship, Maybe we don't have a project or what they're going to work on, but we're going to ask or release open position for in summer internship in the And people will apply, we'll be treating them equally as well, providing feedback to the people who won't be selected, and we'll proceed with the selected people with an assessment day. During the assessment day, basically, company presentation, department presentation, we're going to challenge the candidates one-to-one -one interviews. Okay, other questions? No questions. Okay, then I want to thank you so much. Seize the opportunity when you can, and good luck with your studies. Ciao.